golf meant everything to, to Mr. Bell. Um, uh, it just it, it defined who you were. It defined who he was. Jim's interest in, in junior golf stemmed from his love of the game generally, um, and it was genuine. Jim ran a tournament uh, in upstate New York and, and did so for a number of years. It was a, a great tournament. Uh, it had an international field before anyone else had an international field. Uh, Jim loved junior golf. Anything associated with junior golf, Jim loved. He was a, a stockbroker by day. Uh, his involvement in East Aurora was very much as a volunteer. And the interesting thing is that because he did such a phenomenal job at uh, East Aurora, um, he was hired by uh, Mr. Palmer and Mr. McCormick uh, to at that time go down and run as the tournament director for what was then the Florida Citrus Open down in Orlando. Anybody that ever knew Jim Bell knew Jim Bell was the Bay Hill Tournament. It had name changes throughout the years, but they always could know that Jim Bell was a constant. Jim Bell was a fixture on the PGA Tour for decades. Uh, he was a key ingredient in the success of the PGA Tour all through the 70s, 80s, 90s, uh, and we miss him dearly. He was a guy that just, you just had to like. You know, he was a guy that just, everybody was waiting on to come and just when he showed up, everybody just was his friend. He was a true gentleman, uh, an inspiration to, to so many different people and a real leader in the sport uh, from, from when he first started in junior golf all the way to the innovations that uh, uh, he did uh, at the Bay Hill event and uh, he had tremendous respect of everybody in the industry. He made you feel uh, welcomed. He made you feel special every time you saw him. He was one of the most interesting people I've ever met in my life. Uh, he was interested in what you had to say and he had some of the most interesting stories because of the way he lived. The more people that he could touch, the more people that he knew he was touching, um, and impacting their lives and changing the trajectory of their careers. Um, he would be very proud of that. And he liked the fact of, of, of amateur golf because it was something that he could give back to. He was just one of these men that loved golf, loved kids, loved junior golf, uh, and just, you know, he just lit up when you, when you talked junior golf. You know, Jim Bell uh, had uh, knowledge and Jim Bell had opinions, but Jim Bell had one of the rarest commodities that you find in life. Jim Bell had wisdom. And I remember so many times talking to him about different things, and he would always pause before he, he spoke, and then he would uh, share wisdom with you. Uh, and, and you don't see that a lot, and, and I miss that terribly in our relationship. It's with a great source of pride that uh, the family will have, that I will have, in having a Jim Bell uh, Ace Grant. I think he would be more proud um, of the fact that his name is attached to it. When I heard about it, I was not at all surprised. Uh, this is uh, exactly what you would expect from Jim Bell and, and from his family, and I only wish he were here to see it.